you know, more and more see. If we think of every dog as having a force field around it, we don't want to compromise that at all, especially with the dog. That's how people get bit. I'm starting to see. Yeah, they're just compromising the integrity. All right, so what I need with this dog is he really doesn't, he doesn't give me any trouble. You know, but I need to be able to maintain one, the ability to conjure the dog because I do run with them. I almost got hit by a car the other day. He just came out of nowhere and was feeding and he was kind of far ahead of me and I just, I like to hold on to him right when a car goes by because if an armadillo ran out or something, he could dart, I just put my finger in the collar, but, you know, let me see if I call him. Fadeek! So I want a dog that I can put the collar on this easily. That dog is not saying, you know, this is anything that I don't want at all. If anything, the opposite. You know, as much as I can get him to do without touching him, that's what I'm going to do. Filter merging. Yeah. You can bump him with the page and just say, sit. sit. Yeah. But that, that didn't interrupt the energy field at all. You know, if I'm going back up, that's my move. I'm giving him slack. I'm not pulling him towards me. And he sees I'm going to try to structure the leash. Fetty, yeah. He's all up on me down here. It's not going to have any reaction. Sit. Sit. It's my pager. I still don't have any reaction. Not if you said he's not that good at holding it. Oh, only because I haven't made him that good. Fetch. It would be my job if you start jacking just there. It would be my job to make it to make holding out like this better. That's my job, not not my job to correct for doing that. It's my job to make that seem better. I guess